Hey, how's it going, you guys? My name is Chris Bassi, and today we're going to be working on my short game at Van Buren Golf Course, right near the Riverside Airport. So, you're going to be hearing some planes. We're going to be playing some short game on a par three course. Let's go. All right, you guys, so right there, this is actually gonna be the, the walking cam on the selfie stick today. And uh, yeah, hole number one. I really thought those greens were gonna be a little quicker. I did not expect them to be that slow, but now we got a feel for the green and knowing how it's gonna flow walking today, so getting that extra exercise. And uh, yeah, so hopefully we play a little better round right now than what that first hole was. So let's go. Second shot here, tried to chip on, came up a little short. That'll work. Alrighty, we got a chance at par right here. So just came up close, getting a better feel for those greens and uh, getting a better feel for the speed of it too. Like I said, they're a little bit slower today. Um, I'm starting to get a little feel for it, which is a good thing. So uh, third hole upcoming, let's get it. Swing finally felt better on that one. Right yardage even, uh, pitching wedge to go for that shot and end up right on the green so that's even a better feel and um yeah birdie opportunity so we could get back some of those strokes which is gonna be really nice or minimum par all right let's get it hey guys check out how close i got to getting almost a hole in one right here All right, we got a long one for Birdie right here. Five. We should be able to hold number five right now. Um, feeling a little better. Um, I think I actually should have gotten driver actually right there. I didn't realize it was actually a par four, but to get a little closer instead of using the three wood. But it is what it is. On to hole number six and keep trying to drop down the score. That was a bogey right there, so not ideal. But uh, like I said, every day we're improving, right?
fringe that's the first shot and then that second shot you know try to put it as close enough as i could to the cup and then obviously you just gotta drain that putt to make that par so on to the next hole let's keep getting it all right let's see how the shot was All right, you guys, we're on to the final hole right now. This is the eighth hole. They only have uh, a couple less holes because of the night golf and everything as of the moment. So this is the eighth hole. We went par par. And so let's try to get a par or birdie for this last one. And let's try to get it. Let's go. All right, that swing felt good, but we gotta see how close we got to that pin to try to get that opportunity. Let's get it. All right, so as we're walking up to the green here, there's actually a ball on here. I'm the only person playing right now. So we actually got the ball in green and birdie time. So let's get it. Hey you guys, so we just finished up that round. Um, like I said, there's only eight holes today because they closed down the other side, so the other two holes. So we played eight holes today. We ended up going double bogey, bogey, birdie, bogey, bogey, and then par, par, par to finish out. So we ended up four over for eight holes. Um, definitely good to work on the short game and it feels good to keep on improving. And I'll see you guys out there on the course. Uh, I think in the next video, I'm actually gonna be playing against my cousin. So you'll wanna see that head-to-head -head matchup. And also, too, we're going to be retrying General Olm Golf Course in another video coming up. All right, peace out. See you guys. Let's get out there and get better.